Hi guys and welcome back. Today a really quick update because I have to run to my last meeting for today. You see I had already quite a meeting today with the color that I got in the sun. You know, you can even see a little bit here my sunglasses, the shades where they were. So yeah, crazy day today, but everything is fine besides the market. And let's um, definitely dive directly into it. If you're new to the channel, please leave a like or subscribe and also activate the no notification bell so that you will be always notified when I put out one of these emergency videos. And now let's get here straight into the chart. We can see here that um, exactly what I mentioned yesterday has actually happened, that we were breaking down here so that we were breaking even lower into this support zone here where we are seeing right now some price action. So, but what's gonna happen next here on the four hourly chart? So for this, I wanna get out the EMA ribbon. So, and here's something happening that we did not want to see. So the EMA ribbon has here flipped again into a downtrend. So, and this is also not preventable anymore so uh, the only in the best case scenario that could happen here is that the price action comes here really quick back up above the ribbon the ribbon flips again and we go back into an uptrend and all this here would be just a massive fake out so but is that actually the case or will something else happen uh, happen here so for this i also want to show you um the 250 ema so we got here a bull cross on the four hourly chart so this starts to look like now a fake out um so it will be a fake out if the 50 comes down here all the way down and the price action cannot get above the 50 exponential moving average in uh, the immediate short term. So, and we got, we get supported right now by the 200 down here, but we are really hanging on this by a thread right now. So um, this can, so if this breaks here further down, then we are in real trouble on the four hourly chart. So, and uh, then we will definitely get lower. Then we might hit the bottom of the zone here, all the way down to $39,400. Remember, I told you, if we break 41,700, you can actually short. So congratulations to everyone that took a short here. So you are a massive profits right now. I'm not shorting, I'm holding my long position still and um, will just add more to my position as we getting lower because I expect here um, in, lower regions that I, that I will get to now, uh, definitely a bounce back to the upside. So what are these regions? So I believe that we could potentially see a fake out here to the downside if we break this support zone and then actually get here a bounce back to the upside uh, and then actually continue also our tra trajectory here um, to the upside. I don't believe that we will actually break um, substantially down here all the way, let's say to 36,000 or something. That's something that I don't believe. I believe we will get a bounce um, around the bottom of the support zone, um, maybe a fake out with a wick, and then we go back up. So when we're um, otherwise looking on the daily chart, there um, potentially, potentially, we still have to wait a little bit. If we on the daily chart break under $30,000 and we start breaking lower, then the Wyckoff distribution plan could be actually playing out here in this accumulation zone that we get here potentially a final low, come back up here and then actually break up. And then I would have been right what I said a couple of weeks ago that um, th here this pump to the upside was missing and then we should have come back here immediately into the accumulation range, bounce here up again, create a final low then come up and then actually break to the upside. So that is also a scenario that I definitely want to point out here. That could also be happening. So we will know in the next coming hours what actually will be the case here. But for the time being, I, like I said on the four hourly chart, I don't believe that we will break much further here to the downside, uh, at least not um, much lower than here potential wick to get here massive fake out for the bears. Also here on the weekly chart, that looks definitely not good what we are seeing right now. Uh, we definitely want here on the weekly chart, uh, the price action to come back above the 50 uh, exponential moving average here. So, and you see we are right now here on this downwards trending um, yellow line, on this yellow trend line. So we definitely don't want to break this line because then we would drop all the way down here potentially to $31,000. So what, when we are looking here on Ethereum, also here, um, we can clearly see that we got a breakdown out of this potential bull flag here. Um, so, and we're going here sideways right now. 
So Ethereum is actually holding up quite well for the time being. So and um, let's switch to a daily chart. Yeah, but also here I expect at least another day of downwards movement based here on the stochastic RSI. We have not completely bottomed out here. We will potentially bottom out here today, but that could mean that tomorrow we still get some downside with it, uh, with potentially forming the final low here and then finally also get here a uh, move back to the upside, which will result also in a move back to the upside in the price action. Guys, that's it already for today. So um, we have still... Um, a lot of amazing signals coming through on the signals channel, on the paid signals channel. If you want to take advantage of that, go to the pin, uh, to the description of the video. There is a link to my staff that you can immediately contact my staff or use only the link in the video description to not fall for any scammers. Um, other than that, uh, if you are not on Bybit yet or on Femex, also links uh, for that in the pinned comment below where you can still claim some bonuses for using my links. And don't forget, Smash up the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. And tomorrow you will see me with someone really, really special. So definitely don't miss out on tomorrow's episode. See you there.